cracking guys, welcome back to Franbo. Okay. So now we still have some things to to find. Uh, we can go get the bottle. Or we can at least fill the bottle. Use bottle with faucet. Tap. It's called a tap, not a faucet. Well, not, I mean, you know, unless you're American and then it's a faucet, but it's a tap. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, where or what now? I am unsure. Oh, mysterious painting in a mysterious place. That is indeed very mysterious. The eyes are crying tears of blood. That is sad. So, we need to get this key, but how do we... Ah, okay. Woo! We got the key, motherfucker! Shiny little key, come here. I wonder what door you open. Ha! See, I got past your friend. Oh, dead skulls on the wall, I never thought of this. But I kind of like it. It's just the inside of humans. It's beautiful. Mmm, not really, Fran. I wouldn't really consider the inside of humans beautiful. Where we are, off to now. A wake-up clock. Perfect. Mmm, it's tightly tied. If I want it, I'll have to do something about it. Yay! I got you, little wake-up clock. Okay. The back of the giant cat. This must be for something important. It's quite dark in there. The, um, the eyes follow you. Hello, tree. You're big. Whip. Excuse me, tree. I want the glove. Thank you. Okay, so now we have that. Hello, scary fire thing. Excuse me, I really need the key hanging just behind you. Excuse me, but I do not talk to strangers. You don't need to talk, just let me take the key. If I choose not talking to strangers, not listening is also part of the deal. How disappointing. I have a question. Are you stuck into this tree? I'm firmly attached to it. Why do you ask? I'm just curious. See you later. How about... I'm clever enough... Oh. Seriously? Won't do. Negative. Well, that's pants. Could we brush it? Look, I found the medical hair comb. Isn't it great? I don't know. Hair comb? What is that? Well, it's to make your hair very pretty and smooth. Would you like to try it? I don't know. Is it dangerous? It can be very pleasant if you do it smoothly. Alright, let's try it. Alright, but just promise you won't burn me, okay? I'd only burn if I'm in danger. Be gentle and nothing bad will happen. Okay. I'll be gentle. It worked! What is happening to me? I've never experienced anything like this before. But how? You are Lucy Fern. All Lucy Ferns I've met do this all the time. Really? Well, thank you very much. It feels incredible. I feel like I need to fly away. Bye bye, motherfuckers! That must be the key for the door 103. I can smell it. But I can't reach it from here. What to do? My grubber mustard would be nice here, but I don't have it anymore. You can smell it? Why can you smell it? Can we not whip it? This won't work, huh? 
Oh, okay. Um, a twig? Fantastic. I can reach it. Now I have the key. Woo! Going down. Going down. Should have been more monotone there, but you know. All right, we have to key door 103. Let's use key with door. That doesn't look like a nice place. Okay, I was correct. It's not a nice place. I'm guessing that's Mabaka. Creature from above, get out of Mabaka's den. You are not welcome. Excuse me, but I'm looking for my cat and need to wake up Mabaka. Just Mabaka? Mother Mabuka? For you? Arrogant little infant. And how did you plan to wake her up, eh? With crazy ideas of Cogwind. Cogwind is a nice clockmaker. He's not crazy. Ah, so you know him. I assume you have been to Isterasta. Horrid place, I may say. Too dazzling. Well, that's exactly where I want to go after I find my kitty. Good for you. Your fragile little mind will be safe there with all those boring creatures. I'm going now, you wicked tree. My kitty is waiting for me. Wow. What a big, beautiful face. Are you Mabaka? If yes, I must wake you up. Cogwin came up with a machine to wake you up, so be prepared. Okay. But do we have everything? No, we don't. A working bulb. Ooh! Uh... 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 uh. Uh, no, it wasn't 104, was it? No, sorry, it's not 104, it's 105. I need a bulb. Ouch! The bulbs are very hot. Great, I got the light bulb now. Woo! Alright. So, now we have everything. Why would Palantras give me this? This must be important. I think I must build it. Besides, it's designed by Cogwind, and I didn't get to read the rest. Alright, so combine that with that? Or does it need to go in order? Empty case, we've got an empty case. Working bowl, wake up clock, bottle of water. Okay. This won't work. What? Do we have to actually be inside? here to do it. Uh, the floor is beating like a heart. Is this Mabuka's heart? Mm, it feels fragile and strong at the same time. Okay. No. Yeah, I, I kind of get that. Negative. My school case. My school case. Okay, how do I... Uh... Okay, so I've got all the ingredients. But how do I combine them all then? Oh, I did. Yeah, I, I know it's quite dark in there, Fran. 
Okay, so for some odd weird reason we have to put all this stuff in the back of the, of the cat. Because apparently we can't assemble it ourselves. And the cord. Oh, soap as well, wasn't it? And now he's gonna shit out, I think. Nope. He's gonna spit it out. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This is amazing. The echo clock is finally finished. I seriously thought the cat was going to shit it out, but clearly not. All right. Mr. Mabaka. Mrs. Mabaka, whatever. Use the weapon with Mabaka. Kind of an odd weapon, if you think about it. Ah. Uh, beware of Mabuka. The awakened darkness rises from the unknown. Oh, I'm sorry to wake you up, Mother Malika, but I need a favor from you. Can somebody tell me who this creature is? Quite insolent for such a tiny body. Excuse me, miss, but I, I, I can answer that myself. I'm Fran Bo, human girl, 11 years old and I'm very brave, so you know. When the fuck did you turn 11? You were ten. A human in Mabaka's den? That's amusing. Who brought you here? That would be Remor. I think he is your son, isn't he? Did my son manage to enter your head already? You mean like cutting my head open? I don't think so. Did you drink or eat some sort of reddish potion or beans? Beans? My pills look like red beans, so yes. I took a whole bottle. And then I cannot use violence against you. The power has been unleashed. I hope you find beneath the ground the truth that you seek. Thank you, but what power has been unleashed, can you tell me? The power inside you, don't you know? You were selected by the five realms of ex essential ex ex existence. And I can't speak. To be the keeper of the key. The five realms of essential existence was created parallel with time. What, what are you talking about? The key is the key. Who told you this? The great Volacus from Prime Eve told us everything a long time ago. The keeper will be hunted by the son of darkness after feeding from the red seed. But you are too young, I must say. Too young indeed to be the keeper of the key. There's something about you. Did you... something obscure happen to you? I think Remor killed my parents. Mother Mabaka, can you imagine how it feels? I am all of those feelings, Franbo. I am all the sinister, all the darkness you can imagine. I feed from tears and sorrow, from desperation and fear. But then you don't care if Remor killed my parents. I thought you were nice. I am curious about knowing the reason, if that makes you feel better. Now I understand. It's the reason itself. The truth you are seeking. Go on, Keeper of the Cree. Be brave now. I'll open my heart for you. I couldn't really decide what sort of voice to give her, but yeah, whatever. So this is still freaky as fuck. Oh, that creature's body is made out of baby faces. The bath boy said something about this. I think it's a hijacker. Do I know you from somewhere? You look something from me. Oh, sorry. You took something from me, didn't you, little thief? Is that the old nurse, or is that the nurse that was sat in the um, the reception? Where is my little needle? Ah, uh, did you stab your little friends with? Oh, oh, I know who that is. Yeah, it's the uh, it's the dead skeleton from the, like the first episode that was sat in the wheelchair. We took the knitting needle. What knitting needle? Oh, you the 
that nurse I saw back at the Oswald Asylum. Do I look dead to you? Ah, you little beast. Take a number, would you? And wait for your turn in the waiting room. But Miss Nurse, I don't need medical attention. I just want to find my kitty. Take a number and wait. I won't repeat myself. Let's take a number. I hope I get a good one. Patient number seven. Calling patient number seven. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh, I wonder how long I must wait now. Hours. Maybe days. I've been waiting for a week now. How long has everyone been waiting? Ah, um, I've been waiting for like a month. But I have number two. So it must be my turn very soon. I have been waiting for three and a half weeks. Totally hopeless. Um, excuse me everyone. But is there a way to make things faster? Yes. Become a doctor yourself. That would be faster. And by doing that, you could also help us all. But why won't you become a doctor yourself then? I can't, because I feel very sick. I can't. My eyes. Our eyes blinded. I have this broken arm, you see. I can't be a doctor. I must be a patient. Neither can I. I've lost my ability to frighten myself in front of the mirror. Well, I'm not sick at all. Please let me go before you okay? I can't. I don't even know what meal this I have. That's why I'm here. Hmm. But how can you not know? Do you feel pain somewhere? That's a very hard question. Make it softer. Okay, now he's northern and from Yorkshire. Fucking <laughs> whatever. How can I make a question softer? That's very strange. Hey, have you tried pulling your eyes off? It helps sometimes. Ah, enough. It's impossible to talk sense with any of you. Of course you can make sense of us. You're not the one that sees it all. You've only known us for a few minutes. That's very little time to understand it all. Hmm, <clears throat> that's true. But it would be nice to use some common sense. Why? What does common sense? do that on common sense doesn't. Well, it helps to be better to understand each other. We do understand each other very well though on common sense anyway. Ah, we actually do. We do respect the differences. Hmm, but who is the one that sees it all then? You mean Mabaka? Nah, Mabaka knows everything. It's not the same as seeing everything. Now, I want to wait because talking won't make the way go faster. Huh, alright, thank you for nothing. Okay, so some of these, she's been waiting for three weeks. And the number hasn't changed yet. So in other words, it's going to take about four, five, ten years. My RI is broken. The big guy told me that. Because she sees it all. Okay. So. Yeah, we know you already took a number, Fran. So how? Do you see the screen? I have number two. It's almost my turn. You, no, could we combine, could we be, could we be sneaky and combine this with this? Maybe it works, I wonder know for what purpose. Oh. Well, you never know, I could have chopped the fuckers up. Ah, uh, waiting was fun at the beginning, now it's just boring. Wait. I think my horn won't grow again. I'm going to be very angry because of that very soon. Honestly, don't know. Hey kid, this is my turn now to talk here with the nurse, alright? If you don't wait and leave us alone, I'll tear you apart and eat you. Ew, 
Ew, you eat children? Did you know that we children are actually immature? Hey, hey, leave the patient alone now. The doctor will be... will determine the severity of the illness, don't you worry. Can we not just go through? It's locked, but it doesn't have a keyhole. Maybe somebody must open it from the inside. Maybe the nurse can open it. Can we threaten this with the, the knife? I won't even try that. Oh well, aren't you crap? Could we? I just take them away for you to. Huh. Okay. So, what in the blue blazers do we do? Because I haven't a clue. Would it be possible to exchange our tickets? I have number seven. No, I need to know if I'm in pain. I need to know what illness I have. What if I find out what illness you have? Would you then give me your ticket? Ah, well, sure. I'm still here when you come back. I'll give you my ticket. Yeah, I'll give you my ticket only when you find out about my illness. Okay, let's find out about his illness if we can. Shoot, it's not your turn yet. But I, but I need to ask you. Oh, yeah, we know. Alright, so... How... So how in the hell are we supposed to find out what his illness is? They listen, they see, and they touch. In a way, I feel like I'm back in the Oswald Asylum, but it can't be. Or can it? Mm. Can you please wake up again, Miss Mabaka? Ah, uh, I have so many questions. What does it mean to be the key keeper? Like the gatekeeper, but with a key? Nah. How? Use green crayon with patient. Sometimes things just don't work. Well, do you know what? I'm going to try all of this because, uh, honestly, you never know. Mm, even if it works, I wouldn't know for what purpose. Clever enough to find another solution. Uh, can I give this to you? Ah, uh, won't work. <clears throat> Would it be possible to exchange our tickets? I have number seven. I would like to help you, but it's my turn to help myself, so no. All right, bitch. Would it be possible to exchange our tickets? I have number seven. Mm, that is not convenient for me, I'm sorry, but no. Would it be possible to exchange our tickets? I have number seven. Uh, not really, no. I'm not interested. Fucking son of a bitch. I'll give you my ticket only when you find out about my illness. How the hell am I supposed to find out about your illness? Like... Uh, I'll... Cut you up. Negative. Uh, I thought maybe I could like draw on the screen. That won't work, huh? Uh, probably not. I don't have... Uh, huh? This is very weird indeed. Uh, use the knife on the door. Hey. 
e inyo. Use the knife on the woman. E no. Use Donna. E no. Use that with a woman. Won't work. <sighs> okay, so it's basically now a process of elimination. No. 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 Yes, we do need number two, Fran, but we have no way of getting the number two. I don't know about your illness. I don't know how to check your illness. I don't know where to... I'm at a loss here. One side of the no gold. Oh look! Haha, <laughs> I love this picture of Mr. Midnight. He looks so confused. Mommy and I ate peanut butter and jelly sandwiches that day. I think Mr. Midnight ate a bunch of insects. That's generally what cats do, Fran. It's generally what cats do. Hmm. How in the hell are we going? Alright. Lots of candy in the jar. <laughs> Summer hats, Alice in Wonderland, already took the balloons, I'm sort of confused as to what to do now, because Hello, Mr. Ball. Are you having a lovely time? Are you a friend of Mabuka? Hello, goat. You look a bit like Remor. Are you cousin to Remor, maybe? You are much prettier, though. How in the flying fuck? Ha, huh, you don't scare me a bit. Ha, huh, you don't scare me a bit. I'm a confused. I'm a very confused. I'm a don't know what to do. 
I'ma go crazy if I don't find out what to do. Let still slay. I don't know what to do. I'm so lost, you know. I'm just so lost and I don't know what to do. It's so fucking confusing, you know. I don't know what to do. I want to kill all these fuckers, but I cannot. So I don't know what to do. Anyway, we shall all find out next time, no? And that's exactly what we will do, because uh, I'm out of time. I am confused. I... I don't know. Like... Um, uh, uh, there's, there's nothing... Yeah, there's like, seriously... I need to find out about the guy's illness, but I'm not sure how, because there's no books around here. So, I don't know. But anyway, anyway that's, yeah, I'm going to have to leave it there, because, uh, yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode, and I will see you all next time, and as ever, bye-bye.